I always prep a week before. So over the weekend, I'm already prepping for the next week. What else do you notice that makes them different? Journey? So when I get in on Monday and Tuesday, usually that is an introduction to the next chapter or lesson. So you know that we've been talking about why the Chalta seeds aren't growing in the Bengal Reserve, right? Yes. And so now we're on chapter three. And usually in the intro, we're talking about the chapter question or we're introducing what model or investigation we'll be doing for the week. So we're getting a little bit of a backstory. Plants habitat must have blood. Then there's a reading component, which again ties into what we're going to be doing that week. And the writing component sometimes is a preview before, a preview of vocabulary, or a preview of a concept that we're going to be learning. Sometimes scientists can't go to habitats that they're studying, but what do plant scientists use so they can get so they can get information about a habitat they're studying? Josina? They can make a model. They make a model. On Wednesday, we're ready for the hands-on model. I always spend the whole class period on there because the kids need a lot of time for that. Most of yummy berry bush eat no fruit. I'm sorry that Okay. We usually debrief about lesson one and two, and then we also discuss what happened in the hands-on models. What do they need in order to grow? Benjamin? Space. They need space. Mm. The kids always look forward to the hands-on um, time because I've introduced it in lesson one and two. Five, four. So they're always looking forward to it. What else did you learn from how, how animals can help seeds move to new places? Maya? When they eat the fruit, they, they start digesting it. And when they digest it, it comes out and the seeds are still in there, so then the seeds spread all over. By the end of the week, we're usually reviewing everything we've done, and sometimes I'm ready to introduce another part of the next, maybe lesson one of the following week. It just depends on how our week goes, but we're always either writing about what we did in our hands-on lab or just discussing the concepts that we learned.